Welcome to the Wellness Lab. I'm Dr. Alok Patel, and I'm joined today by my all-star dermatology colleague, Dr. Caroline Robinson. Hey, guys. This is the place where we walk through so many different health topics, demystify them, and help you figure out what to do. Today, we're going to talk about retinol. Retinols can actually do a lot of different things. When we're young, they can help unclog the pores, improve breakouts, and then when we get wiser, they can help with fine lines and... That's a <laughs> nice, that's a nice spin on fine lines, I like that. I don't like to say the other word. When I was a teen, I was on Accutane because I had really bad acne but there yeah. are like lighter formulations for people? Absolutely. Retinols are a little bit weaker than retinoids and they're over the counter. So they tend to be less irritating, but even people with sensitive skin can be irritated by the retinols. Who is the target demographic who should be thinking about retinols? I think that at least by the age of 25, when we're starting to notice some of those lines creeping in around our eyes, or maybe that, you know, little angry frown face. This thing right here that has like the white dipper. This one by The Ordinary has 2% gran active retinoid. So it's specially formulated in oil-free, alcohol-free serum okay. that is going to be hydrating for the skin without the irritation. If you're brand new to retinols, this is a great place to start for sure. All right, so we got the CeraVe. Yes. Resurfacing retinol serum. Tell me why this one is awesome. I really love this one because CeraVe, like all CeraVe products, incorporates three ceramides in it. So ceramides are these things that really, really hydrate the skin. And when we talk about retinols and retinoids, we really need to talk about moisturizing. This is like a one, two step. Your retinol and your moisturizer all blended in one. So this is great for like the lazy <laughs> retinol user. <laughs> the last question I'm gonna ask. Yeah. One thing that caught my eye is that this has licorice root extract. <laughs> I'm a huge, Licorice fan. Licorice is a botanical ingredient that we see in a lot of products that help with hyperpigmentation. Good for your face. Yes! I'm already it's sold. Good. It's now, good this that. one looks like nail polish, the design it's of it. a really pretty bottle. This one is by Bioessence. It's from Belgium. This one actually has an ingredient called Fucuchiol, which... Sounds like a Dragon Ball Z character. <laughs> Fucuchiol is a plant-derived retinol. So it's going to give you the benefits of a retinol without the irritation. Another important point about retinols is that they are not safe for pregnancies. One thing I have to stress is again is that if people have any questions, concerns, you're checking in with a board-certified board dermatologist. Like Caroline. This is the Wellness Lab. Thank you for joining us. Now you have a little bit of a treasure map. You have a legend. Yes. When you're trying to navigate the crazy world of retinols, I'm Dr. Lok Patel. And I'm Dr. Caroline Robinson. And if you listen to everything she says, your skin will stay smooth like butter. <laughs>